So I've just been doom scrolling as you do on Facebook and I found myself in one of the Facebook forums for mainstream sleep consulting. don't know why I'm in the groups really, I think it's just a bit of sport if I'm honest. And I don't normally engage in posts at all, I just like to roll my eyes and scroll on mostly, but in this situation I didn't. So I found myself reading about a sleep consultant who has a client who has got an 18 month -er, very healthy, happy boy, um, sleeps 12 hours solid at night, yet has not napped in the day for about three weeks. They continue to put this toddler in the cot for an hour and a half every lunchtime. And the poor little thing screams for the whole hour and a half. And the person writing this post said, please help, I don't know what's wrong. Well, naturally, I couldn't scroll on, could I? So I said very diplomatically, I'm not really sure what the situation is or what the problem is. This child is having 12 hours of solid sleep in 24. And we know that the worldwide range for a one-year-old is between 11 and 13 hours, according to, to actual statistics. So this child is getting a really good amount of sleep and seems quite happy for it, but is only unhappy when being made to go in the cot. And after three weeks, he's still not napping. I don't know what there is to discuss. Clearly, this is a healthy, happy boy who's being forced to have a nap when he doesn't want a nap, when he doesn't need a nap. Anyway, I was very diplomatic in my reply, but I'm just waiting to see what the general reply from everybody else is. They might lynch me. They might throw me out of the group. I don't know. I don't know what they want. It's common sense. It's normal. But I just thought, isn't this amazing how expectations of what people think sh children should do create problems? Instead of telling that mum, you're doing a fantastic job. Your child is actually just a little bit advanced for their age maybe and ready to drop this nap because they have the brain capacity that they don't need to stop and download and reboot mid midway through the day. This is something we should celebrate. But instead, we're pathologising it and treating it like a problem. Anyway, I don't know. Share your thoughts below, please.